welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to style this simple maxi skirt with a matching top. I might coordinate out the matching top and just try something else. In a recent video, which I'll link down below, I styled one black dress for 28 days in a row, mixing and matching different items from my wardrobe. So, and some of you requested that I do that with a maxi skirt. So today I'm obliging. Here is a maxi skirt that I purchased from Target recently. I love the color. It's a beautiful pink that I think lends itself well to both summer coordinating, winter coordinating, autumn and spring coordinating. So I've pulled out some items from my wardrobe, different pairs of shoes and handbags and tried to pull some things together and create a number of different outfits. So let's get started and see how many combinations for this skirt I can create. The skirt I purchased recently from Target and the t-shirt is also a purchase from Target. It's just a cheap little t-shirt that I thought I'd be able to coordinate with the skirt and add some different colors over the top to just change the look. So let's start adding some simple accessories. Let's tuck the top in, maybe add a necklace. Let me see what I pulled out today. And let's throw on a simple jean jacket. Let's grab a bag. This little clutch will do. What do you think? A bit too much with the hat? Yeah, I don't think it goes with the colour. Let's just leave it off. Look number one. And I think that it's just easy breezy for a nice cool summer day with perhaps a hint of a little bit of clouds in the sky if it's getting a little bit chilly. Okay, let's swap it out for something else. Ooh, I love this jumper. I only recently bought it from Kmart. And I absolutely would love to style it with this skirt. I think the pink from the design here will complement the pink of the skirt. Let's try that out. Okay, I know this isn't in my cup of tea and with a big sloppy jumper like this, I wouldn't wear these sandals. So let's swap these sandals out for maybe my favorite boots. Yes, I love this look. What do you think? I love these boots. I'm actually going to be looking for something similar to these, but in black and maybe in also tan for this winter. I think they just add a certain edginess to any outfit. And I think the design on this top actually complements the skirt and just makes the whole outfit that little bit more casual and chic. It is so comfy and I don't see any reason why I wouldn't be able to wear this out. What do you think? Is it a new favorite? When you're playing with your clothes and you're trying to coordinate different looks, how about trying sometimes to pull out an additional color from the top that you're wearing, in this case, black or gray, and incorporate maybe a blazer and dark toned accessories. How about we give that a go? Oh, I think that's cute, but these boots are a little bit too pale for the tops. So let's anchor this outfit with some darker shoes and a black handbag. Okay, trying some different accessories. I don't like this look. I think maybe the jacket is a little bit too dark for the skirt, but I don't think that it's not a viable combination. A little bit more edgy. And now let's try something else. I love coordinating something silky that looks a little bit more elegant and chic with something a little bit more just easy breezy every day, like a chambray shirt, runners, and an easy tote. Let's do that. I think I might type the single it in to create a more seamless look. Let's add a pop of colour to coordinate the whole outfit. And a nice big tote. I really like the idea of wearing a windsheeter over this skirt. I just think that the silkiness of the skirt lends itself to a contrasting and more leisure wear outfit. And here I have more of a purpley toned windsheeter that I think really resonates with the colour of the skirt. Let's see what this looks like on. I like it. What do you think? Do you think we should wear it with the sneakers or with the boots? Hmm, let's try to look with the sneakers first. Yes, I think this works. And then let's just add a really ladylike bag for the whole ensemble. I think the contrasting the intention of the items just works well together. Hmm, I think I need something up here. Let's have a look at what's in my wardrobe. Okay, I like this look. I know, do I look a bit like a bag lady? I think I look a little bit nonchalant, shall we say? And a let's grab a bag for this. Yep, I like this. What do you think? Let's 
break away now from pink on pink and try a few different combinations. How about a nice simple white t-shirt with a little bit of interest with the puffy sleeves. Let's tuck that in. Throw on some heels. I know it's very monotone. How about we add something around about here to just break it up a little bit. Tie a scarf around the waist and grab the bag. Sit. When choosing a scarf to coordinate with an outfit, I like to coordinate it with something that's got a little bit of the colours of the whole outfit in it. In this case, this scarf has some lovely pink and blue motif in it of birds, which will pick up the handbag and the skirt and the top all in one and make the outfit more cohesive. I like the look of the skirt with another windsheet, so let's try and coordinate it with the white and the blue now. Just this simple country road windsheet will do a trick. Don't mind the cat fur and the dog fur all over my clothes. Let's try and leave it long. Do you know what would make this pop? Some blue high heels. I think the scarf will work well again here. Just a simple knot. All we're doing, ladies, is just playing with our clothes and playing dress-ups. And then once we find an outfit that works, we'll just implement it in our rotation of how to style this skirt. I think I like the idea of the jean jacket over it. Okay, I think this can work too. What do you think? What I did in order to make the scarf a little bit shorter, so it was, I felt it was dragging down a little bit too much, was I just wound it back on itself and then tied another knot on it. It does look a little bit heavy, but I think it goes well with the windsheet underneath. My blue trusty tote, and voila, another outfit. I have to say, I love adding in some high heel pumps, some elegant shoes with more of a casual outfit and I love styling elegant items like this silky skirt with the satin pumps with just a jean jacket and a windsheet. I just think it's playing with fashion and I don't think we should be afraid at any age to play with fashion and create looks that are more individual to us. I love the idea of playing with opposites when it comes to colour coordinating. So let's try this skirt with blue now. I love how the design of this t-shirt with the red, pink and pale pink print on it complements the colour of the skirt and the blue is a lovely contrast to the pink that I think works really well together. Let's add in some further accessories and of course if you want to make it a little bit more edgy but throw on a blazer, you sure can. I feel like this top tucked into the skirt is sort of cutting me at an odd spot so I think I might just pull it out. I love these little clear hair ties to just create a knot or a little bit of interest in your clothes. That's it. That's a bit better. The cut in my torso is that little bit lower and I think a little bit more flattering. I love this outfit. What do you think? Have we found one of your favourites yet? I personally like the look of the blue with the pink so much that I had to try it on with a jumper. I can feel my hair getting flatter and flatter with every top that I take out and put on. So here's this lovely blue jumper that I've shown you before. I love the fact that it's high at the front and lower at the back. But let's have a look. Let's try it on with, I think, some white sneakers. I'd like to lighten it up a little bit. I love how adaptable this skirt is. You can just make it look chic with just different tops and accessories, or you can make it casual and just that little bit more fun. Let's see if we can do something with this top, perhaps to make it more tucked in all the way and make it more cropped. Let me go and get my belt and do my belt trick. Voila. Let's add a pop of color up here. And of course, if you wanna add heels, you can always swap out the sneakers for heels. They don't have to be satin pumps, anything blue will do. And of course, a nothing screams office like a white shirt. So let's try on a white shirt underneath. That's a little bit more office traditional. I love this crisp white shirt. I love the embroidery on it and the, the detailing on it. I just think it makes it so smart in an office environment. I think I'm going to leave it out. And because I'm wearing blue shoes with it, I'm going to throw on a blue jumper. I think the shirt on the outside down below is not working with the outfit. So what I'm going to do is just tuck it in. I know, I think I could take this to the office. Let's make this skirt now a little bit more summer friendly. I've shown a few combinations that are winter appropriate, but let's loosen it up a little bit and get casual. 
I love combining different fabrics. In this case, a linen turquoise shirt with the silky satin of the skirt. I think the shirt works because it's got the pink detailing in the collar that recalls the pink detailing of the skirt. What works for me is just tying it up in a knot. Nice and simple. And then what I'm gonna do with this look is just add pink colored sandals. These are a recent addition to my shoe collection. I bought them this summer from Amaya, they're Takuto, and they were on sale, so they were a bargain. And a pink bag, very casual, but ladylike. And let's add another pop of color and bring the two together by, by putting in a necklace. Do you like it? Now let's see if we can make this skirt super casual, almost like wearing loungewear at home. Uber comfortable and of course if this is a little bit too uber comfortable for you and you wouldn't go out in winter time wearing slippers or scuffs how about we change out to boots and add a nice scarf you know the jumpers over a skirt is one of my favorite looks i love these jumpers over jeans but even more now over this skirt i love this combination it is just so cuddly and warm but cute let's try some different colors shall we oh i love the combination of the gray with the pale pink it is so soft but so comfortable and the two items just go so well together i think i just need to add a little bit of a pop of color with the use of a necklace over the top done what do you think and i finally i couldn't finished combinations without adding in my favorite cream winter jumper with a high low front back and the side slits if you like this skirt i only recently bought it from target it's probably on clearance now but you never know you might be able to find it and this is a size 14. i think you could see that you could go on forever creating new looks by playing with items that you already got in your wardrobe what you need to look for when you're considering adding some different colors is how will that color coordinate with the item you're trying to coordinate it with is it going to be a contrasting color a bit like with the blue or is it going to be a complementing color like this beige color or is it a tone on tone with pink on pink so many different combinations i really enjoyed starting this video for you as you can appreciate it does take a long time to a come up with the creative for it and then b recording it and editing it so if you enjoyed it please let me know in the comments below it basically is your comments and your like and your subscribing is a vote of confidence in my creativity and lets me know that yes there is an audience for what i'm creating and that you enjoy it and you're finding value in it if you did please give it a thumbs up consider subscribing and please share this content with anyone else that you think might also enjoy it until next time my friends thank you so much for watching have a fabulous day bye